Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Outriders video. In this video, we're gonna do, I'm gonna do my first time expedition to the Eye of the Storm on tier 15. My build pretty much is good. I'm managing to do this one on uh, tier 15, but I've never been in this one yet. Like for example, you can see that best time, etc. So this is gonna be my very first time going into this crazy expedition wish me luck <laughs> let's go with my devastator build by the way the walking bomb all right let's go crap I forgot what was the time needed I didn't pay attention. Damn it. Alright, whatever. Let's go. What the uh, hell? What the? It's the leader of the ferals. Oh, what? Shazam. We gotta fight this do dude again? Do it again. This guy is tough. Outrider. I barely beat him on freaking tier 13, I think. World tier. I didn't have the gear though. Hey, what's going on? What are ah the obelisks? Damn, I just wasted time over there. Okay, incoming. Screw the birds. Come on, group up. Yeah, I know the mechanics of these things. You just gotta stand. As long as nobody gets into the circle, it progresses. Shoot, that, t that time is ticking bad. I don't think I'll be able to do it on gold. Silver, maybe. Oh, there comes the queen. I mean, the muzzle. Quicker, please. I'm gonna keep her off the circle. Ooh, Shazam! You need to get back in there, Outrider. You've come too far. Don't let it all be in vain. The hell? This is our final push. Damn! Usually I don't have issues with those mothers, man. But this time she beat my <laughs> booty, man. <laughs> beat me up real bad. One punch. <laughs> I need to off my defense by then. Okay, so let's nail these things. Yeah, my, my shooting damage ain't that good. Alright, let's forget about it. <laughs> there comes the mother again. Come on, hurry up. Come here. Oh, but those things hit hard. No wonder she... Oh, sh... Oh my god. Oh, he 
some healing. How long is this obelisk going to take place? And there's three of them. Damn. Hell no! What the hell? This is dumb. Oh, maybe this thing is doable only with the... Uh, teammates. Because it, I think you can like have one person per totem. Because look, solo, you, I don't think it's doable. Like, first thing that comes into my mind with this thing is uh, one person here, the other one on the other obelisk, and the other one on the other obelisk. Because solo, you see, I, I did it, right? But now I need to do this one, and then now I need to do the other one. But the time, current time, look, it's just, it's just not good. So... My best guess, you need a, an entire team here to do this. Definitely. I'm gonna do it probably in bronze. <laughs> if the boss doesn't kill me. <laughs> Jeez, this is fun. Oh, they come with mummy. Ah, oh, it's not mummy. Ah, oh, crap. I think with this guy, I gotta go out. Taken, right? And I could have used the, the actual power to dodge. Oh my god! That was freaking close.
guess the other I'd like to see spawn those big freaking running things that charge you all the time. Oh, I'm about to, I'm running out of ammo, dude. Oh, my shot is out of ammo too. Damn, where's the ammo? I, I'm not gonna even do it on bone steel. <laughs> Sheesh. I got beaten up. There's another mechanic you can do to solo this thing. But no, I don't think so. These obelisks take way too long to get lost, look. <laughs> Is it done? No, oh Still going. Hey, we're done. Shh. Okay, uh, I think you can speed this up if you, if I wouldn't get out of the area of the circle. When those two, I forgot those, the name of those beasts that use the beam, that shoot the beam. You can still wait for them. That should help, but still, I highly doubt that it will help you to do this on gold solo. You need a team. This is crazy. No legendary loot for this one because I'm not even gonna do it on bronze, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But I still consider this if you're able to complete at least one expedition on uh, 
tier 15, I would consider that build a good build. So I'm actually gonna make a separate video on this build that I'm doing, running right now. Because you can see it's doing pretty good. But have in mind that uh, they can nerf it at any time. So I think I'm gonna do the build tomorrow. Maybe make a few adjustments, but it's already ready as is. I don't even have one of my pieces of my gear is still not level 50, which is level 40. But it's still doing a good job. There we go, see I was right. Those big walking get freaking interrupting beasts. Oh shit. Get out of my house. The good thing is the ammo box is right there. How much more? Oh, sh... <laughs> oh. Yeah, you definitely need to do this. But wait, that's dumb. If I remember correctly, uh, the amount of legendary percentage you get from this expedition is exactly the same as uh, any other expedition on tier 15. And why doing this then? You gotta pay for 40,000 uh, pods, right, to do this expedition. And solo you can't because, well, I, I assume you can't because you got three totems that you can't do it by yourself being at the same time in three places, right? And uh, this one is exactly made for like team play and I would say that the reward, the percentage of getting legendary loot and the amount of legendaries like X4, right? Like we can get back to the four. Is uh that should be increased. And then people definitely would love to invest their pods into this expedition and uh, and do it because the return on the investment is is better. Plus, you need like a good cooperating team and a team that can hold one of these by themselves. Because you know, once you get more people playing, the game becomes even, even harder. Maybe they told him they uh, go faster once you're in a team. I'm not quite sure because I haven't been playing uh, multiplayer because uh, when the game the much or after the patch, uh, there is infantry wide bug happening if you're playing multiplayer. So I would highly recommend not to play multiplayer at the moment until they fix that bug. But yeah, I still got a lot of questions. If you know how to do this on gold, feel free to comment down below. <laughs> There you go, I'll run out of time. Not getting no tier. Good. But let's see if I can at least beat that guy.
Come on, when are you gonna end? Oh, okay. I think it's final stage. Yeah, final stage for sure. No, we're done. Let's get the ammo. Okay, cocaracha. Oh, beat you up. Oh, great. Oh, I hate those things. <laughs> yeah, and it talks now. Oh, okay, I remember he shoots something. I haven't been fighting this guy in a long, long time. Shit. Gotta go kill these things, man. What? Excuse me. There you go. No more light bulbs. What you gonna do now? Okay, I, I need to stop him. What are you doing? Ah, overload. You got his mechanics. Ah, hell no. Get out of here. That hurt. Oh no, you don't. The good thing is this thing also interrupts. Ah no, I didn't interrupt this time. His copies? What? No way. Outrider. My vision is getting oh worse. Oh my god. <laughs> that is dumb. Whoa, these guys don't go away, do they? I got beaten up. Next time when they pop, I'm gonna deal with you guys first. Jeez, damn. That was crazy. And those things don't heal. Oh my god, yeah. Not again. Oh, 
This is fun. Get the hell out of here. Yeah, doing a mistake equals you're doomed. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't. Ah, oh, you bastard. Ah! That thing probably hits hard. <laughs> On this tier. Whoa, I'm running out of ammo. Holy smokes, man. Oh, oh he spawned long. More, I more feel like it's about to happen. Damn, man. What the interrupt in the head? Get the hell out of here. Already. Damn it. No, you don't. Okay, that thing hits hard. No, you don't. Oh shit. Yes, you do. Son of a...
one mistake, as I said, one friggin' mistake. Oh my god, man. <laughs> what? Oh, come on. No, man, you need to do this expedition in teams. I'm, I'm out. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, my eyes. Definitely for this guy, you need more firepower. But. I didn't do that bad. <laughs> she is crazy. Alright folks. This is where I'm going to be calling it the end for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I could have beat him if I didn't do that mistake. <laughs> Just one. But it wasn't that bad, was it? I mean, this build is actually pretty good. So yeah, I'm going to consider a finished build. Like if he can solo at least one expedition on gold or, you know, do something, I don't know, or pretty fun builds, whatever. I still haven't gotten to do any build videos, but this is the walking bomb build and basically the logic behind it is that it explodes all the time. As you can see, uh, shadow common, 2K, uh, 200k damage, uh, reloading, it makes an explosion, 380k damage more. Uh, same ex reload 380k damage boom 100k damage with the claymores this uh, reloading 100k damage plus 100 180k damage uh, then we've got what we got here Kingslayer uh, firepower for critical hits on elites seismic impulse 100k damage per six seconds uh, then we got more damage to Elite's Ice Trap whenever I get 30% HP. If that guy is not, you know, that glowing bluish color, he gets frozen. Then I got the Shield Blast whenever the shield gets broken and the shield I get from these boots right here. Once again, once I get 30% to of my HP, when it blasts, it does 147k damage. Uh, reduces, oh wait, this is increases the damage against the Elites. This is the re reduces the damage between the Elites and damage absorbs 52k armor and 10% resistance uh, and life of the party incoming damage is reduced by 3% for each enemy in close range I think I need to do a little bit of it and um, let me ask you this question what do you think I should consider uh, a good build a good build that can kill that guy on tier 15 or a good build that can at least like uh, do gold, silver on any ex other expedition. So yeah, I'll leave it up to you. Uh, maybe I'll do my first build the way I see it, and then, man, that was crazy. My ass hardly like held. Thirty minutes, Jesus. <laughs> That's a freaking hard expedition, man. <laughs> all right, folks. Thanks all for watching. Y'all have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys lucky at. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. From the ashes we rose into the future we'll go